y'all want, we can weigh it. What we can do is do a field dress weight, and we can do a carcass weight and see what that yields. Let's do it. Hundred pounds. So dress weight, we're starting at hundred pounds. And you think there's probably thirty pounds of meat, boneless meat, boneless right? meat. You're gonna yield about a third, roughly. Yeah. It's headshot. That helps. I like to go the easy way. There you go. So how many of these pigs you cut up in your life, you think? Several hundred. It's getting more and more every year. <laughs> I'm gonna try to leave all the fat I can on these ribs. What I like to do is get past the tail head and then release the ribs and then you can pretty much pull the rest by hand on these smaller pigs. We, we really like these guys here. Well, that's cool. You can pull that down. He's fat. There's a little fat, man. Yeah, he's nice. But that's not fat enough to make bacon with, right? No, and we've had people ask us to make bacon out of their wild pigs. You just don't have the thickness of the meat covering on your belly or your ribs. It'll be more fat than meat on your bacon. Oh, so it's a lack of meat, not a lack of fat. Yeah, it's plenty of fat. But I got it's, you. A, it's a lack of meat on these wild pigs. You see the big difference between pulling and knife skinning. Yeah, yeah. No, that's a good lesson, man. Strange feeling for me to watch somebody. Keep reaching for your knife in your mind. Thirty pounds. About thirty percent skin, about thirty percent meat, and thirty percent bone. So just the head and hide, not counting the feet, you've already lost 30% of the carcass. On bigger boars, you'll lose 40 to 45%. This was a young boar, so it gives you an idea on how much meat you'll get off of these. Yeah, pigs. so when guys go and they come out and they got like a little milk crate full of meat, they're like, what? They'll show up with two big ice chests, <laughs> and you'll send them home with half of one, and they think you're pulling their leg, and you're not. Yeah. We did pretty good with a perfectly 100-pound boar. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Makes the math easy. Yeah. So you don't mind doing that, just taking a hose and cleaning it? Always. Yeah. On all my wild pigs, personally, I put them in an ice water bath for about 48 hours. But you really? It makes a big difference. It'll turn the meat a prettier, whiter color. Uh -huh. Drain out a lot of the blood. The big thing, too, you'll notice when I was skinning it, my knife hand never touched my dirty hand, my clean hand. So my dirty hand never touched the meat, my clean hand never touched the hide. That's real important too. Gotcha. So, you so don't you're not be... moving bacteria from the hide to the meat. Big time. Yeah. Not just bacteria, but smell. Smell, smell. equals taste. <laughs> yeah, 75 pounds, which makes sense. Well, no, because that weighed 30 <laughs> yeah, that and he 30. weighed 100. The hook weighs 5'2. Oh, okay. <laughs> got, got you on that one.